hi my beautiful Taurus welcome to my channel goddess of light 1111 if you are new to my channel welcome if you are returning subscribers welcome back this reading is for my lovely Taurus Sun moon rising Venus and Jupiter thank you guys thank you universe universal energies ancestors spirit guy archangels ascended masters please give my lovely Taurus a clear precise honest message for the highest good all right, Taurus, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to hit the like, the subscribe button, the notification bell below. If you are returning subscribers, welcome back. I do appreciate each and every one of you that are supporting my channel. I'm grateful and thankful. I'm sending lots of love, no beginning, and prosperity away. Energies are fluid. This reading may or may not resonate with you. If it's not resonate, please check out your other breath chart placement for more clarity. Take what resonates and leave the rest. So anyway, for those of you Taurus, Aries, Taurus, Cusp, that are celebrating today, Aries, Taurus, Cusp, happy birthday for you guys <laughs> in advance. I want to be more than friends. So beautiful energy for you, Taurus. So for some of you that are Aries, Taurus, Cusp, that are celebrating today, happy birthday in advance. So I want to be more than friends. So someone that's coming to you, Taurus, they want to be more than friends. This relationship is going to lead to more than friends. Just being near you is intoxicating. Oh, Taurus. So you got someone in their feelings, honey. This person is, they are intoxicated when they, they so you know that's not a good thing, right? So when someone is being around you and stuff like that, they, it's become toxic so which means that this person can become clingy they can become codependent and stuff like that so be mindful and be careful with whomever that's telling you that you know your love or your energy get me intoxicated so this person get to be clingy or they get to be codependent so be careful with that energy so i am afraid to contact you so hey there's the past <laughs> <laughs> so you guys might be chilling i'm getting an energy i'm seeing you know two people you know chilling so there might be some of you that's already talking to someone you guys are getting to know each other you know and you guys are just hanging around and stuff like that and then boom there's the past the past so the past want to talk to you the past want to contact you but you guys are trying to move forwards here so i look for you everywhere yep so the past want to return. I'm not saying they are returning. I said they want to because they kind of have a little bit of fear of contacting you because someone in here is afraid, uh, um, afraid you might be rejected them. But the past is trying now. My life is not as together as it seemed. So yes, definitely without you, Taurus, things is not the same. There's a lot of change. That's what I'm getting here. This person is not the same whomever you know this person is you know that's what i'm getting here let's get in some cards to see who is this person we have playfulness so for some of you i felt like you're having fun healing family issues wow okay so your love life benefits as you forgive your parents so this could be you know someone in here that's went to a lot of child childhood trauma childhood issues and they're still stopping them from being in relationship stay optimistic about your love life positive thinking and faith will bring you woman so this is someone that's still trying to heal from whatever happened to them in the past that's what i'm getting here taurus <sighs> So this person could have, remember how, how I say that, you know, this person could become codependency and then we have family issues here. So this might be someone that has um, codependency issues due to lack of not having, you know, their parents around, they're not having, you know, someone around here. So deception, because this person might be wearing a mask, they might not showing you who they really are because, you know, this person doesn't want you, um, to feel some type of way because they enjoy you know the time you guys are spending together right now so let's see we're gonna ask who's coming towards you guys who's coming towards Taurus here so 
so we have wow okay so we have an empress it could be so you know what i'm getting here i'm getting this person that's coming towards you guys the empress maybe you have children with this person a mother you know someone that is nurturing caring and loving and let me telling you this you know i can say that but it's not always true because you know, not all mothers supposed to be a mother. Not all mother come as, you know, caring, nurturing. Sometimes this person is just, the impress come just because this person is a mother or a grandmother. That does not mean they are a good parents. So that's what I'm getting here. There's someone that's coming towards you guys. I'm getting is an empress. You guys gonna have children together. For some of you, it could be your mother that's still afraid to talk to you. Your mother could want to talk to you. That's what I'm getting here for some of you. But there was someone, there could be, and there could be another earth sign because all we have here is earth. We have the Empress, we have, um, you know, and for some of you that's looking at the Empress as Taurus energy, it could be another Taurus that's coming towards you guys, it could be a Libra. So again, we have Taurus energy here, we have Virgo. So we definitely have, um, definitely have some Earth sign that's coming towards you. But there's someone that's coming towards you guys, this person is single, you know, this, they are trying to find balance, there's a need this person is need to find balance with two of pentacles. Someone he could be juggling, but doesn't need to find balance here. Show me this person energy, spirit. Show me this person energy. Oh, I figured that much. I've already know that much. <laughs> This person is toxic. You know what I'm getting here? And I can tell you guys in um, what kind of toxicity this empress is. That's what I say some of you. It could be your mother. Your mother could be older. And she's very young. That's what I say. Um, not every mother need to be a mother. And for some of you, as good as a mother. For some of you, your mother is not a very good person. I'm sorry to say that. I don't say not all of you, but I'm getting in here a toxic, you know, a toxic mother. This person is very, they, they do certain things and stuff like that. And someone in here, them, they need, they need to heal with you. And for some of you, it could be a mother of your child. You know, it could be someone you have children with. This person is very toxic. And, you know, Knight of Wands. Mm. So we have Knight of Wands here. There's a need. You know, this is someone that is very fickle, very in and out. And we have Knight of Coins. So for some of you, it could be a Capricorn coming towards you guys. Very fickle, very in and out. You know, and I'm getting in here. This person want a relationship with you they want some type of stability with you but this is someone that is very fickle also very toxic that's the uh, that's the energy that i'm getting here with the devil what this person want Taurus to know spirit what you know what what do they want to tell Taurus? what do they want to tell Taurus? the wall a cycle is coming to an end so this person is you know in the nine of wands this is someone that feeling victimized you guys might be at a distance from this person and they're feeling victimized they're also feeling like they're feeling like the wall is closing so they're keeping some type of secrets with the moon here this person is keeping some type of secrets but this is someone that they're feeling some type you know victimized with the wall then this person in here someone in here feel like the wall is going to end they're not going to do the things they want to do with you Taurus you know this is someone that feeling victimized so whatever they do wrong is like someone in here you know how people play the victim that's what I'm getting here someone 
someone in here whatever they do wrong they take no responsibility for the action because they are um in a victim mentality and stuff it's like oh it's nobody's fault never nobody's fault but them like i said someone that is very toxic you guys are dealing with you know just being near you is intoxicating someone in here might be even there's some type of jealousy i'm getting someone in here might be actually jealous of you Taurus, and it could be a mother i'm sorry to say that yeah, I'm sorry to say that. Wow. Excuse me. Mm. What action is this person going to take towards Taurus Spirit? What action are they going to take towards Taurus? And then when I ask this question, they'll be flying, you know, all of, you know, the cards just be like four of wands. We have eight of swords. This person action towards you guys is stability, but they might be going through, you know, some insecurity. So there you go. Here you are. So someone here knows you are stable. This person, someone in here is trying very hard. I'm getting in here. This person might be trying to keep you stuck, you know, in a house. <laughs> oh my God. I'm sorry, Taurus. Like I told you, this person is toxic is heck they are very toxic we have eight of swords um four of wands and queen of coins this is you this is the whole thing just said the whole the whole reading just aren't uh, done over with someone in here is trying to keep you stuck at home they you know you might be dealing with someone that is jealous of you who doesn't want you to be in a relationship Taurus. Oh, good Lord, Lord have mercy. I pray I rebuke this energy in the name of Jesus Christ that I love. Amen. I rebuke this energy. Oh, I'm going to be rebuking it for you guys. I'm so sorry. This this person just get me and my feelings. Someone in here is very toxic. Whomever the empress is, this person is very toxic. They are in the devil because the empress followed the devil here in the world. This is someone you guys might be at the distance with. This person wants you to stay single. They want you to. They want to keep you stuck at the house. Let me telling you, spirit say, free yourself, love yourself, unconditional love. This person, sending them love, send them their way. What this meant, this person intentions towards Taurus spirit? What are their intentions towards Taurus? With the four of ones, with the four of ones, ace of ones, this is someone that wanted no beginning with you. That's what, you know, palace of ones here. This person have a lot of, you know, they do care for you. They do. This person might want to uh, have a new beginning with you moving, you know, moving, um, moving in with you, moving with you. That's what I'm getting here. They want an opportunity and stuff like that, but they are, you know, this is someone that is low key. I'm getting a, you know, a person that might be low key, jealous of you. And we have this son here. So you know what? Clarity, happiness, healings. What their intention is to heal with you. Someone, oh, good Lord. Someone in here intentions, they want to heal with you, but they are a little bit toxic. So because of their energy here, and we have the emperor at the bottom. See, there's the emperor, and we have the empress. Whomever you guys are dealing with, toys. So you guys might be in the energy of the emperor standing in your ground. Maybe there's a need for you guys to stand your ground here. And, you know, be in the emperor energy, whomever the empress is. Like I said, someone you could have children with. You know, the mother, the father of your children. Or for some of you, it's your own mother. I'm just saying. A mother, grandmother, somebody. Mm -mm. Let's clarify the impress, shall we? Spirit, clarify the impress, please, for Taurus. Clarify the impress, please.
so for those of you for those of you so see they the impress this person need to heal there's a need for this person to to restore balance there's a need for this person to change and we have queen of pentacles so whomever this this empress is because we have the queen of pentacles here repeated themselves for those of you you might be dealing with a taurus also an earth sign that is very toxic that's what i'm getting here you might be dealing with another another earth sign that is very toxic queen of pentacles they might be very stable they might be very grounded and stuff like that but there's a need for this person to find balance there's a need for this person to change that's what i'm getting here because i ask who's coming towards you that's not you know this is not you this this queen of pentacles here it's someone else so there's a need for balance there's a need for healing there's a need for change this person need to change they need to trans transform whomever they are that's what i'm getting here let's clarify the devil spirit clarify the devil please clarify the devil yeah this is someone you are the distance with i already say that because this followed by the wall two of wands four of cups and we have queen of wands yeah this is someone like a mother figure a mother figure a sister somebody that i, I knew it I know it. Like I said, see, Queen of Queen of Cups. I mean, Queen of Wands here. So the devil. <laughs> my goodness. So we have Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Four of Cups, Two of Wands. This person could be in the occult. Whew. Someone in here trying. This is someone you guys are at a distance. Whomever this this devil is. You know, this is someone you guys might be at a distance and they see you standing in your power here. You know, that's what I'm getting here. Someone see you guys standing in your power and you guys are unbothered. You just standing in your power. No one can hurt you. That's what I'm getting here. Someone in here is trying you very, they are trying you towards, but they, they realize, someone in here realize that you got just as much power as they do. That's what I'm getting here. Let's clarify the moon. Because someone in here is trying, is testing your patience. Someone in here is testing your patient. They want to see how far they can push your button. That's what I'm getting here. But they realize that you are very powerful. You know, four of wands, six of swords, you know. Ace of swords. Some so someone in here keeping the secrets. But, you know, whatever that secrets they keep, whatever that secrets they, they keep and stuff like that, so it should will come out. That's what I'm getting here. Six of swords, four of wands here. This is someone in here keeping the, you know, where they are, where they live, the, you know, a move they make. Someone in here could be physical move, physically moving and then they keep it a secret. Which is that? That's none of my. That's none of nobody business. Why you move? It is a good thing. So for those of you toys that are moving stuff like that, you keep that a secret. Good for you. Let's clarify Queen of Coins. Yeah, you guys come as the emperor. You stand in your ground. You stand in your power. You might be feeling stuck. See what I've been saying to you guys? I don't know who you guys are dealing with. Like I said, there's someone that's trying to keep you trapped. But also, it's like a spiritual. It's like spiritual and non-spiritual. That's what I'm getting here. You know, spirit is blocking someone from you. And this person is trying to keep you trapped. As you can see, Queen of Queen of Pentacles. This one is you guys. You standing in your power. You sitting. You know. You uh, standing in your power. You sit still. Um, being structures. Being stable on your energy. You stand in your ground. But spirit is also is fighting someone else that's trying to keep you trapped. As you can see, eight of swords here and the seven of wands. So spirit is blocking this person, but they are trying to keep you trapped. 
it's like spirit you know uh spiritual attack between you know spiritual and you know evil at the same time spirit is blocking them but they are trying to keep you trapped let's clarify four of wands please Yeah, we have the moon. We have the moon, three of swords. There could be a lover that is secretly hardworking over you, Aries. And it might have to do because of you, because of what's going on with you here. So that's what I'm, I, I say Aries, Taurus, I'm sorry. Because four of ones is Aries energy. That's what I say for some of you, you are a cusp. You are an Aries, Taurus, cusp. That's what I'm getting here. So, you know, don't... um. Don't come at me like you saying Aries. Yeah, I know what I say. It's because some of you are Aries Taurus cuss that's dealing going through this and stuff like that. You might not even know it, but spirit does. So we have the moon, three of swords, and the lovers. There's a choice. You guys need to make a choice here when it's come to your feeling, your emotion. Don't let fears, you know, don't let nobody, don't let nobody making you fear. Don't let nobody um, scare you. That's what I'm getting here. Don't be scared. You can do this. You can get out of this energy and stuff like that. Just sending love to this, whomever this person is, because I don't like this. This, whomever this is and stuff like that, that doing this, like I say, could be someone you guys have children with, a mother, grandmother, nurturing someone in here. But you guys are standing in your power here. You guys are still standing in your power. You can, you can get out of this energy. Praying hard, praying hard. Send them love. Send them love. Unbind what's binding. You, you didn't, you know, yes. If, if it's a mother, you know, someone that is, you know, a mother figure to you guys, they, you know, they birth you, but you can unbind, you can remove the cords that, that between you and, you know, people that try to keep you stuck. Let's go for Eight of Swords. <laughs> wow. All I can say, guys, is wow. So we have Nine of Swords. Nine of Swords, Ace of Cups. Someone in here is trying to very hard to keep you trapped from no love. I've been saying that. Someone in here is trying to keep you guys stuck, try to keep you guys trapped for you guys to have anxiety, sleepless night. And like we said, the devil, Seven of Swords here, you know, we have the devil. We have seven of swords. We have the moon. This is someone that is jealous of you. But guess what next? Divine timing. We have the wheel of fortune here. To divine timing, to time and stuff like that, you guys will be fine. No love will come. The heck with this person. Let them go find a holes and go bury themselves in it. I don't really care. I'm a little bit pissed off at this person because, you know, I don't, I don't give up. Listen, I'm pissed. I am really a little bit, you know, this person aggravated me because who the hell are you? So we have King of Swords at the bottom. Yeah, standing in your truth, standing in your power will will help this person. Send them love. You know what I'm getting here. Send them love. Be on your merry way and be happy, Taurus, and continue focus on yourself. Because this person, they, you know, whomever they are and stuff like that, they can go sit somewhere. Yeah, this is all about jealousy. This is all about envy. You know, someone in here definitely jealous of you guys. <laughs> Yo, it could be your own damn mother. Are you in love with me or my potential? Someone in here might be, might be, you know, infatuated with you. This is not even about love. They're just infatuated with you. Could be maybe you beautiful. You you got a certain you got a you got you grow spiritually you got certain aspect of you in here this person kind of jealous of you someone in here the jealousy is driving them mad and try to keep you stuck try to keep you from moving forward to no love definitely here is that you know uh, spirit is fighting you know with this negative you know this is positive and negative fighting against each other here we need to talk about everything. 
I am so lost right now. I am confused. Let them be confused. Alright, Taurus. I love you guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share the video. Bye, Taurus.